<clears throat> Welcome back to Bianca's Tarot. Today I'm going to be doing a <clears throat> tarot reading on Robert Pattinson. I have, <clears throat> excuse me, I got a huge yes to read for him. So, um, yeah, I don't know why I do feel like I'm meant to read for him tonight. Um, I personally am a fan of Robert Pattinson. Um, actually, hold on. Let me, I have to turn down the sound on my TV. Okay. Sorry, that's better. But yeah, I am a fan of his. Um, I love the Twilight series. I thought it was a lot of fun watching when I was growing up. And I think he's a great actor. And I saw Batman and he was really great in it. Despite what anybody's saying. So I'm a, I'm a fan, but I will read this with no bias, um, I do feel drawn to read for him. When I did ask for permission, I got a huge yes. So let's get into his energy. Okay. <coughs> All right. Um, so Robert Pattinson. How's he doing? Wisdom, suffering and silence, patience and planning. I think um, right now he's learning a lot about himself. It feels like he, it's not so much spiritual, but it feels like he's in a learning phase in his life where he's like very open-minded and he's kind of taking everything in and maybe learning from elders or mentors of his. It feels like there's like a lot of wisdom being, um, I don't know, like called on him. I, I know that sounds weird, but I feel like he's like going through, like this year he's learning a lot. I feel like he's learning a lot about himself. Um, with the suffering and silence card, I feel like he's, not being completely honest about what's going on with him to others. I feel like deep down he's not, he feels like he is suffering in silence in the, in the sense that he um, has a lot going on internally, but he's not expressing it to a lot of other people. I will see what that is. I got the card moving on. I feel like he it's related to like kind of the universe forcing him to move on from something. And he's sad about that. Um, I don't know what it's about, but I do feel like he is being called to his destiny. And I feel like he is in a place in his life where he is actually learning a lot about himself. I feel like he's really open-minded at this time, this point in time. And he might be going to people or just kind of like in a in a state of I feel like he's also talking to someone like I feel like he's going to somebody even though I just said that he is suffering silence I feel like there's a he might change that soon I'm feeling like he's gonna go like help people he's gonna go to people for help I feel like that I feel like um there's maybe a need for someone in his life that he could go to to talk about certain things that he's going through I feel like he's um I don't think he's going to stay in this energy. I feel like he will move on and um, learn to ask for help and learn to go to people that he can trust. That was kind of confusing. Sorry, I was actually channeling deep just now. Um, so let's see what Tarot says. Let's see what Tarot says with his energy right now. I have the Ace of Wands, Two of Swords. Right. So there's a lot of passionate things coming in his life right now with work. And in life in general, I feel like there's like new projects, new things he's focused on, stuff like that. Um, I think he's having communication issues. And I feel like it's... Like, he doesn't really trust. It's interesting. Um, I feel like there's a conflict in his life towards a woman. 
um, who is this? I don't know. He's he's not um, in a. There could be an issue with his mother as well, but it feels like or this person is a mother. I think this woman's a Taurus or like has Taurus in her chart. She's like, there's an issue about. Um, there could also be an issue about pregnancy or something. Like um, obviously he's not pregnant, but it feels like there's an issue with pregnancy or a woman being pregnant, and there's like a lot of. Um, confusion and doubt and miscommunication with a female all right so i don't know what the specifics are but those are just the things i'm channeling here it feels like there's like conflict over a woman conflict they're not seeing he's not seeing eye to eye with some female right now and it's kind of um annoying him and at the moment um and it could be in regards of a pregnancy or something um Like I said, he is in like this open mind state of his life right now. But I also feel like um, there's a warning for him to not make rash decisions at the moment. Let me just focus this. There's a warning to not make rash decisions because I feel like um, if he does that, it's not going to end well for him. Not saying he's going to die with the death card, but I feel like he needs to kind of um in the near future kind of just think a little bit more rationally with things and there's an issue with some women i don't feel like it's a mother i feel like the woman could be a mother or there's like a, a like a something about a pregnancy um so that's kind of the only iffy thing i see in his energy all right so let's Get. so let's just jump into his love a lot of people requested this reading uh, um with robert and zoe from zoe kravitz i didn't feel drawn to like read for both of them but i will ask about his love life and i will do a question about how he feels towards her real quick so for his love life what's going on there I think he's taking a break from love. Um, I feel like he might have feelings for somebody, but I don't feel like he's with someone, like boyfriend, girlfriend, engaged. I don't think he's actually with someone. I think he has feelings for somebody, but I don't feel like he's with anyone um, at the moment. I feel like he is kind of um, still grieving the loss of an ex or someone he misses from a past relationship. I think he just wants to kind of take a break from that and focus on other things. He does have feelings for someone from the past. I do feel like he still misses an ex. I don't know who. Um, I can ask. Yeah, he definitely misses a connection. I feel like he's heartbroken about something that didn't work out. Um, he's definitely heartbroken about it. I, I don't think I'm meant to know who it is, honestly, but it could be a Gemini or someone with air in their chart, or I feel like it's someone that ha could have air or earth in their chart, but it feels like more of an air sign. Um, air or earth, maybe both. Anyways, um, let's see what the Oracle has to say. So honestly, he feels more single to me than like with somebody. And I feel like he's just kind of taking a break. I feel like he actually is pretty like upset about how his love life has been. I feel like he's actually really disappointed um, and heartbroken. It feels like, I almost feel like he was broken up with or there's a feeling of like still feeling love for someone he can't be with anymore. Um, let me see. All right, so let's get the energy for his love life. I mean, I don't really need the Oracle cards because it doesn't feel like much is happening there in terms of anything serious. Um, this person isn't available. I think he will have a new love eventually. I just feel like he's not that available for love right now. Um... Yeah, he's in a phase where he kind of just wants to go slow and 
maybe date, but nothing like serious. And see how I have the card past life love. I feel like he misses somebody or he's thinking about an ex or something. Okay. Um, I want to see how, so I'll get a cards about how he feels towards, um, I think people want to know, I, I get requested about F, FKA Twigs a lot, FKA Twigs, and I also get requested about Zoe, so I'll ask two questions for them, so how does he feel towards, um, FKA Twigs again? So I'll do her first, and then the sun, nine of swords, three of swords. He feels still hurt by her in some sense. Um, and they almost could have had a child together, or there was talks about um, a child together. I feel like he's, like, there was a lot of stress with that relationship as well. Um... So how does he feel towards Zoe? I know him and Zoe don't date, but they're kind of like co-workers in a, in a technical sense. Um, Nine of Wands, the Tower, Five of Cups. I don't feel like he feels any emotion for her like that. I feel like he's not even... He feels like they definitely wouldn't work out. He doesn't even feel like they'd make a good couple. He feels like they're like not compatible. But he feels completely different from her. I don't think he feels any, um, I don't think he's like in love with her or anything like that. Um, he actually doesn't, he, it's either he's too focused on other things or like he really doesn't feel like that strong of a tie to her. So let me just get these cards for Zoe's. So how does he feel towards Zoe Kravitz? I hide behind material things. Um, don't take these cards too literally. It's just... I feel like he's thinking about someone else. Like, I feel like he's kind of emotionally connected to somebody else. And I feel like there's a feeling of, um, like, he doesn't have that much in common with her. Or something like that. Um, it's kind of like the same story. I'm not saying he thinks she's materialistic, but there's an energy that I feel like it's just not really like he's, I don't feel like he's that like, I don't feel like he's crushing over her like people assume. That's just not what I'm getting. Um, right. Okay. So I did love, let's do career. How does he feel about his career? Five of Wands. He feels like there's a lot of drama with his career or people involved in his career. Um, is, I don't know why I keep getting some issue with um, a woman here. I feel like there's people in management or like part of his, however he needs to do his work, that it's like people aren't getting along. Um, which is like there's drama in terms of his career. I also feel like um, there's some stress about this career. Like he loves acting, but there's a there's stress coming with his acting career at the moment. I also feel like he's um, he doesn't feel that happy with his career. To be honest, I feel like he's not like in love with his career as we speak. Like he like likes what he does, but I also feel like um. It comes with a lot of stress. Why is the tower here? I keep getting, there's an, there's something about, I don't know if he has issues with his mother or like an issue with um, a, a mother-like figure. I don't know, it feels like there's like, um, it, there's a disruption with a woman that's a, affecting his career as well I don't know if his personal life is also affecting his career but I keep getting this message of like a woman that he's connected to somehow that's also like causing some stress or something I feel like there's some stress about that related to his career I don't think it'll be the worst case scenario like he feels it'll be I think he will eventually get back and on doing things he loves again with his career 
you know but i also feel like right now there's like um drama and i i'm surprised because i'm i'm also getting the same message about like some woman or something like a woman um i just want to ask who is this woman the moon it's weird i don't know it feels like he doesn't want he's worried about a woman affecting his career somehow i don't know what it is i don't know if it's blackmail or something i'm i don't think it's that but it, there's some sort of issue with like oh he feels like a woman might affect his career in a negative way it's related to him personally i'm confused so i'm not gonna <laughs> go deeper but yeah there is some drama with his career right now and people are not seeing eye to eye and he doesn't hate acting or anything like that but there's things that come with it at this moment that is very stressful and annoying for him. Um, okay. So it's like kind of taking the good and the bad at the moment. Um, he's not that happy with it though. Um, all right. So let's see how he feels towards his the friendships in his life. Um, Wheel of Fortune, the star. I actually do feel like there's a friend in his life that he so I have a young guy here I have a so I have an Aries Taurus Aquarius I feel like there's two male friends or more majority of male friends in his life that he actually travels with and does a lot of fun things with and they're very optimistic older wise there's an older guy here like a lot older than him actually could be like an older man um that adds a lot of light in his life and like optimism and things like that so i feel like friendships are good i feel like there's more male friends though than female friends for sure um i'm seeing like two guys there all right so family how's this family three of cups six of cups he loves his family there's so much love there like he loves them he'd like die for them um the females in his family, um, I feel like he's really connected to. Like, he's very, he's like, there's just a lot of love there. And I feel like he tries to see them whenever they, whenever he can. And I feel like he's really proud of them and they're really proud of him. Um, there's some sort of child there's a lot of children being brought up so i don't know if there's people in his family that are having babies now um i'm feeling maybe somebody could have twins or something like that but it feels like there's a lot of celebration with like younger children around so i'm seeing like a lot of children um and i feel like there's definitely more children to be had in the family so somebody could have news about weddings and children and all that fun stuff um, but overall, really positive. I feel like there's like a lot of things to be happy about um, that he's happy about that's happening in his family. Um, I'm seeing a lot of children. I feel like there's a lot of like a lot of new. He could be like an uncle as well. Um, I don't know if he has siblings, but I feel like there is like a child that does look at him like an uncle. Um, okay, so what do I want to end the reading with? Um, I think I did everything across the board. So now I just want to see the future energy for him. There will be a relationship. I think he'll become a mature guy. And I think he's going to kind of have to be, he's going to have to face some truths about himself. Um... Yeah, he will have a relationship. I don't know with who, but it feels like he will be with someone. It'll be like a soulmate connection. He keeps getting fours, so four is important for him. I think he's going to have to face some... Like, this is about kind of like facing the truth about some things you don't want to face within your life. So I do feel like that's coming up for him. But there's also a relationship, and I see him kind of getting tired of something or growing bored of something um so that's just let's so let's see what tarot says and then i'll end the reading all right um be 
future, Seven of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, okay? I keep getting issues with, like, a woman for him. I don't know whether it's, like, haunting the reading. Um, he needs to be wary of, like, a woman in his life. She's got to be 30s, 40s. I think she's a cold. Um, there's an energy of, like, a, a woman lying to him. I don't think it's romantic. Um, it doesn't have to be romantic. I got the moon here. Uh... There's a woman, there's an energy of like a woman lying about him or a woman lying to him. I don't know. Uh, I also feel like, but I don't see any, I'm not getting like tower moments. So I don't know. If I was giving him a personal reading, I would just tell him to be wary of some sort of older woman in his life somehow that like has a tendency to like lie. I don't like her energy. I also feel like, um, and I'm sure you, a lot of people might to jump in the comments and say oh I think it's this celebrity it's not don't it's nobody you guys would know so don't jump to conclusions I also feel he's gonna have a lot of new projects that he's happy about and excited for he will be in a relationship I do feel like he will be in a relationship I don't know with who but he's gonna be kind of falling for someone for sure Water sign or fire sign? I feel water sign or fire sign. So I see something changing in his love life. Um, I do see him kind of... I see him growing up. I keep getting... I feel like he's just going to become more mature um, than he is now. Like a lot of growth. And I also feel like there's a feeling of a love interest. Like a real relationship coming. So that is my reading. If you would, guys would like to book a private reading with me, the link is in the description for that. Support me on Patreon for more exclusive celebrity readings and other perks. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.